bastardi. What? <laughs> what? I'm hungry. I'm hungry. I wanted one cookie before doing my yoga and, and they're not vegan. <laughs> I can't. I won't. It's not that I can't. It's not that I can't. Daddy, be careful what you say. <laughs> okay, so. Welcome <laughs> to our first uh, daily vlog. Uh, this is how I would call it. I'm here with Teddy and we are pretty much on fire. That's just the overall explanation. But pretty much we want to start doing uh, videos more consistently. We're gonna head down to Chile together and we wanna, we're planning, we're thinking about making like 30 videos in 30 days to show the real, uh, the real everything. Uh, behind all this life and goals and, 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 and lifestyle and so what we said though is that we should try it out first in Maui and Hawaii here where we are the daily vlogs, the daily vlogs because we're not sure you know how it feels how much work uh, like the workflow and all of that and so yeah today we, we're gonna go for it first day we're probably gonna do today tomorrow and Monday before the probably and so it's on, it's on. Let's see how it goes. Are you excited for it? Yeah. There you go. I'm gonna have a yoga session because my body is pretty tired from yesterday. Yesterday I had one of my best days ever at Okipa. <sighs> Waves were like mast high, over mast high. It was just insane. I, I loved it and I, I went for it. I tacked, you know, one of the first times that I really did that you know I always struggled I struggled for years in bigger ways and yesterday just I was ready I was ready mentally physically and you know having Teddy filming and all just all the setup was perfect and so actually last night I didn't sleep that much I wanted to sleep because you're gonna have three days like full well, power we were both talking we were like oh my god we're so tired yeah. like, we're gonna go home and both fall asleep and uh, I was up until like 11.30 editing a yeah. video just because I got like addicted editing a personal video and uh, and and I text that a response in like two minutes, and I was like, "Oh my god, this fucking is so late too." You were editing. I was watching all the pictures from yesterday, and uh, yeah, I'm just so excited. It was amazing. It was amazing. It feels great. It's like a step up in my riding and my windsurfing in general, and um, I was ready for it, you know. And it feels even more special to do so after recovering from an injury, you know, last year, but. Whatever, I'm just excited and I want more. I just want more, you know. And uh, today looks like it's gonna be a good day. Not as big as yesterday, probably smaller, so perfect for tricks. Goiters, 360, like air tweaked, full power, like hundreds, you gotta do hundreds. And uh, yeah, gotta get my body ready though, because <laughs> I'm a little sore. <laughs> tell the people that I tell them, what do you do, how often? I try to do it at least like, uh, fifty percent of the day, of the day. So like every other day. Yeah, every other day. Three, uh, like three, four times a week. And usually the other days I go to the gym. But lately I've just been too busy in the mornings. Um, I kind of uh, put aside a little the physical training, also to have more energy for the windsurfing, and you know, just doing some yoga. Since really some some work in the morning, and um, yeah. But that's how I like it, you know, one day yoga, one day gym, and then windsurfing every day, hopefully. <laughs> right, finish the, let's say, morning routine that I don't do every day, but I try to do as much as I can. I, I meditated, which is, um, you know, now it's a, there's a trend with all the meditation and lots of people talks about it. And I think it's cool. It's just like, uh, to me, it has helped a lot, especially uh, with this book that I read that is called breaking the habit of being yourself and it was it was a real game changer and besides giving me like a completely different perspective and you know idea about life and how to face life there had it has it had this uh how do you say guided kind of a practice a meditation practice at the end that i learned it's like seven steps and it has been huge in these last uh, six months i've been practicing it and um it hasn't been easy, it took me a while, you know. Usually it was one week for each step, but it took me more than that to learn it. But whatever, now I'm doing it all since a few months and that's been helping me so much just to have more clarity, remind myself who I want to be every day, uh, what I want to achieve in a way, because it really is a, a game changer. Um, 
so yeah, I try to do that as much as I can, especially when I feel a little down or when, I, when I'm facing some challenges or some problems. Um, but hopefully the goal is to have it every day with the training and uh, the yoga. So that's what I've been working on. It just puts me in a great mood and a great energy. I feed it, the body. The body feels different after, as, as you finish that. But now, it's time for some breakfast. <laughs> We're gonna have an oatmeal, so some oats with uh, some fruits. Do you want some? I'm good. You're good, you sure? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. I'm gonna do I'm doing some. Oh my god, this is the mass, this, this is the over mass high wave that I hit. Look at the bomb! I went for it! But oh, this is years of mental training. So that's the sale. And I went on this bomb and I went for the lead! I should have tagged there actually, but whatever. Look at that. Doom! I don't know what I did after because the way kind of mushed, like yeah. All right, we morning routine edited, do some stuff. We're ready to go. It's 11:50. I wish I would have uh, been ready a little earlier, but we're still good. Uh, we got some co coffee here, food, water. Teddy is ready. He got his lunch too. Good job. <laughs> we're good to go, bro. Looks good. Let's go. Full power. Full power. Full power. The waves. Okipa is firing. Okipa it's fearing. No, oh, I guess you have to lock it. Firing, fearing. Firing in English firing. and fearing in Italian. <laughs> keys, car firing. keys, music. Shoes. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Water, water is fundamental. Then I got coffee. I got it all. Wow, I look. So you see, I forgot the wetsuit, but I don't need it today. I'm gonna go with no wetsuit because it's a nice day. Waves are smaller. It's Whoa. Beautiful, Prius. You never know. It's mine. That's amazing, yeah. Good job. <laughs> I'm not gonna commend my car <laughs> because I don't care. I don't care about cars. Just need to get to keep and attack that way. The board that I'm gonna use is the Hyper that I got from Antoine. The Hyper Proto that he was using last year. I gotta check the foot straps because it felt a little large yesterday, but this is the one. It's 85 actually. It's a Proto that he was using last year while designing the new board, the new Hyper that is in production this year, 2023. What I'm so stoked about is that the new board is gonna come with the uh, MFC K300 fins. Check them out. These are the best quad fins that I've ever had. These are just machines, you know? It just changes, completely changes your board. So much more grip, you can be so much more aggressive, so much more radical. I love it. Okay, we're good All to right, go. Let's go. Yeah, bro. We got the best parking. We got pretty sick conditions. It looks like way smaller than yesterday, but still pretty good. Windy. I think, yeah, it's windy. I think on the... On the sets is like overhead, so that's perfect for tricks and stuff. Uh, full power, bro! I'm gonna go full 260s goiters. Uh, what's up, little bomber? What's up? <laughs> uh, little bomber, not anymore. I used to call him like that five years ago before he become became a beast. <laughs> but uh, you heard that? <laughs> Bastardo. <laughs> No, but it look, it's looking good. I thought it was going to be way more crowded, but, uh, you know, I think we're in time. I think they were just waiting for us. They were waiting for us to make the show start. Oh! All right, I think I wanted to go 4-4 because it looked windier, but it's still not. So I'm going to go with the magic. Ah! S1 Pro. This sale is just insane. I made a bed this year, ordering it. I was like, for six or for eight? I already have a four four and a four eight. Why should I get a four six? And I was like, light wind, wave riding days. And that was exactly the perfect choice, bro. It's just insane. The, the range that this sail has, it's so soft, it's so powerful, but again, not heavy, you know what I mean? So it's just, I uh, love it. Uh, so yeah, this one with the, the Proto Hyper, Hi tiny tail. Hyper Proto, the tiny tail that, that Teddy loves. 
It reminds him of, of a surfboard or what? I don't know. You just love it. I gotta check the screws. Uh, remember that. So actually yesterday in the first session, I didn't rig this properly. I guess like this is okay. <laughs> I film and you rip. That's it, that's the combo. That's what we're looking for. That's why we're here. That's why we exist. I know. <laughs> All right. Wind is picking up. 4.6, 8.85, 8, full power. Teddy's gonna go at the, which, ang which angle you're gonna choose today? Probably similar to yesterday. Similar? Or the, or the tree. You don't want to try here, right? You don't want to try here, right? I'm gonna try. You do you want to try this angle? You don't like it that much. Because then okay, you're going cool. away from the, the action. Yeah, you're, is coming away you're right. I'm going away from the camera. But still, we might, we might try one day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But whatever, bro. I'm gonna go full power. Uh, I'm on it. Andiamo. Attacchiamo tutto. Attacchiamo tutto. We attack everything. First session done, that was pretty sick. I had a lot of fun. Today, smaller waves, uh, lots of tricks. Actually, the first two waves, I'm sorry because Teddy wasn't, didn't get there, and didn't get there because I went in the water too fast and I had like one turn, one goiter. One turn, one goiter on two waves straight. And I was like, oh, that's amazing. But uh, whatever, I got some other goiters. I crashed a lot, 360s, goiters, turns. Oh, that was super fun. And Teddy, he's such a cool guy that he just uh, tried to save a person on the rocks. And so, oh my God, no, fuck. That's bad. Okay, give me. How did it go, bro? All right, there you go. That's a good, that's a good. You don't need nice. health insurance. Nice, have. nice. Now we lifeguard. There you go, there you go. All right. I had a pretty big lunch. This morning I said all those beautiful things about digestion and everything and then today I did a mistake. But whatever. I, I had too much food but I'm good. I'm gonna go for a second sesh. She's surprised that we were filming. How are you? How are you? Can I tell you in the camera? Yes. I Oh, I'm So... the man. Not just the wind, uh, in We push inside and outside of the water. Yeah, exactly. There you go. That's my last word. I'm going to go. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going for a second session. Uh, I'm going to push my turns more. You know, less tricks and more turns. So we go.
a pretty speedy second session, but you know, I was a little tired. I gave it all this morning. Um, still, I got some good waves. I got like, I crashed a few goiters, but then I landed one that felt pretty good. I actually, I actually landed in the wide water. My back foot came out of the strap and uh, I, I almost thought, oh, okay, that's gonna be a crash. I lost it, but then I was still in balance. So I was like, oh, well, oh wait a second. I might, I might recover this and I recovered it. So that felt good and had some, I feel good turns. Uh, but yeah, you know, it's just uh, as I was telling you actually, Teddy, before, it's just, uh, it just feels great because I feel like I'm riding, I'm windsurfing in the water, fully in the zone and, and most of all, just so much lighter than before. You know, like before the injury, for one, two years, I really felt stuck with my level and like, while I was in the water, I wasn't really there. I was. I had so much stuff in my mind. I was thinking about sponsors, like problems, emails and stuff. And that impacted so much my sailing. I wasn't even enjoying it. And so, you know, in a way, not in a way, the, the injury was a real breakthrough because like, it just stopped me. It just said, stop, wait a second, face all your issues, face all the problems that you're being bringing, you know, around for so long and, and just like, solve that and then get back stronger and that's that's what i did you know so i'm stoked about that and uh i'm just uh first of all happy to be in this situation right now but also i'm proud for for the mindset that i had in, in this in this last year you know and, and all the people that have helped me because you know without them would have been way harder so just feels great and I want to keep pushing. That's it. I just want to keep pushing, keep having fun, and getting better and better. Well, the audio is amazing. Well, it's not about the audio. This. Oh my God, you're a fucker. We can use this as a vote, like as a little music. End of the day, you know. Do I really have to explain everything to you? Yeah. We got lucky because it was a pretty sick day. Conditions were super good. I enjoyed it a lot, even though yesterday is so long. But uh, yeah, feel sick, and tomorrow we're back, aren't we? Eh?